shall we begin? What's up guys? Moo Maniac here. One second. You're probably guessing right why I'm taking med meds med making uh, taking heart attack meds. I know the new Star Trek trailer. How cool is that to make my life happier? Okay, not only we get one aus one incredibly awesome trailer of um, Star Trek Into Darkness, but then there was another that just came a month a month from now, and it was awesome. Just so cool. Oh, yes, this is so. Uh, this is cool. I I cannot wait. This is. This is just so cool. I mean, what can I say? This trailer is even better than the other trailer that I just reviewed. I mean, wow, this is like... I mean, all the other trailers, they talk about Benedict Cumberbatch as the villain, at, well, as the villain and stuff, but then this trailer actually um, takes place with uh, the crew. And they do... And the, tra and the trailer just talks about the crew, which that's so interesting. I mean... It's it's so awesome. I mean, you see like Kirk going like, I could take down this guy. Pfft, he's just a regular terrorist that I could beat him down. But then later when he come, but then when his crew comes up with the spaceship enterprises, and then it, here comes John. Here comes uh, John Harris. Yeah, that's Benedict Cumberbatch's villain's name. And he comes in with this super mega, big, big enterprise enterprise ship. I mean, it is twice the size or even big. It's like I don't know, ten times bigger than the inter ten times bigger than the regular Enterprise, and then like, and then like the whole crew was just looking at him like, "Sir, we are definitely screwed right there," and that's what everybody's faces was like. They're all like, "We are incredibly screwed." I mean, how could we beat like how could we beat with such a small ship like this? How could we beat something as big as that? It's just outrageous. And yeah, and yeah, and then like Kirk, I love it how Kirk like, just just looks at it, and then like he turns around and goes like, "I'm sorry." Like he's sorry for getting into this mess. Like he didn't knew this was gonna happen. He thinks he could just take on take out this guy, bam, just like that. But then later, big shit, big freaking ships comes in right at their faces, and they go, "We're all gonna die." You know that we're we're just all going to die. That's our biggest prediction ever. We're gonna die. Just, we're gonna die. 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 Yeah, and also speaking of dying, I'm also suspecting some characters dying too. I mean, have you ever seen like in the first trailer how you see like there's some guy's hand like this and then there's Spock's hand, Spock's hand like this. I thought it was Spock who was dying just like around the con, but then Spock was on the other side of the glass. I'm like, oh, right. So, who's this guy? So, I'm probably suspecting it's some other character, or it could be uh, James D. Kirk. And this movie's giving out a lot of hints for who's going to die. I mean, the trailers. Like, well, like in the trailer, they show who, like some guy is going to die. I mean, I'm suspecting it's going to be James D. Kirk. And then in the prologue where Spock was in the volcano, and then, um, well, and then like the ship can't rescue him or anything, and then... Yeah, he's yeah. Spock was just doing this, which he looks like he's gonna die. So I'm either suspecting Spock's gonna die, or James D. Kirk is gonna die. I'm gonna bet it's gonna be James D. Kirk who's gonna die, cause, well, Spock was in the volcano in the first minutes in the movie, and then he's in the rest of the scenes of the whole movie. I'm guessing it's gonna be James D. Kirk. I'm guessing he's gonna die. And also, Benedict Cumberbatch, his lines are still awesome to hear. Can't even guarantee the safety of your own crew. Now, shall we begin? I mean, there's this one line that he says in the movie where he says, like, No ship should go down without her captain. And I'm like, That was from Khan. I'm not kidding. That line was from Khan. From Star Trek 2, from Star Trek 2, Wrath of Khan. It was Khan. Yeah, that was a line from Khan. I mean, 
Benedict Cumberbatch, as a villain, a Star Trek villain, just said a line that was from the second Star Trek movie. Well, Wrath of Khan. Yeah, he's Khan. I mean, the internet keeps telling me it's James Harris, but, and so is everybody else, but, he's Khan. I'm just gonna call him Khan for now on. He is now Khan. He looks like, he kinda looks like Khan, his jacket looks like Khan, and he even says lines like Khan. And has a creepy voice like Khan. This is definitely Khan. I don't care if anybody says this is a different villain named John Harris or a guy who is based off of a villain in the original Star, Sh Star Trek series named Gary Mitchell. I don't care. He's Khan. To me, he's Khan. Definitely Khan. I don't care who else he is, but he is Khan. So, yeah. Um... I guess that's probably all I had to say about the Star Trek trailer, but yeah, it's just, ugh, just so cool. It's still on YouTube. Check it out. It's really, really awesome. Now, my ultimate question today is, well, it does have to do something with Star Trek. Well, I guess I could say, who is your favorite character in the Star Trek um, series? Yeah, so. Like and subscribe, answer my questions in the comments below. Check out my other videos, they're really cool. See ya.